Hello everyone, this is HHO for all. Just want to show you an update on my brick cell that I have here. I've added one more row of PC slot covers and I've also sealed up the terminals so that way I don't have any escaping current. Um, I'm trying to uh, wrap up a few of these projects because it seemed like it, all the projects that I was doing um, Every time I'd, I'd get almost done with a project, um, I'd start testing the project just to see how it would turn out, you know, see if I got decent output. But then I never actually put it into an enclosure and tested the output. Um, there were a few that I did, but I wasn't really impressed with the output that I got. So anyway, I'm trying to uh, make amends for that and, and get some of these a uh, little bit more completed so that I can get some testing done on them. Um, this one right here, um, I've already got it set for the enclosure. The uh, nylon bolts here rest right up against the edge. And there's about a half inch gap on either side of the cell here, on either side of the plates, and about a half inch gap below the plates. So that way it's not actually touching anywhere inside of the fuel, uh, inside of the container. And uh, hopefully, you know, I should be able to avoid any heating issues by doing that because um, I've had one of these boxes that warped so bad that I couldn't even use it and uh, I completely lost my seal on it so I, I don't want to go through that again but um, I also have another development um, which will help me out with getting testing done so um, what I've got here is I've got two one liter Mountain Dew bottles that I've mounted together underneath with a 3 8 inch hose barb and the way that I have this set up is uh, there's also a hose that runs from this hose barb up to about right here uh, it's not connected up to the hose barb it just goes up to here and it's resting on the, the side um, the water I've, I've got exactly one liter in there right now and the water pressure fills up inside of this hose and then matches the water line over here so um, the way it works is when you hook up your gas into here sorry about my voice I'm coming over a cold here I'm trying to get over it um, when you add pressure to that it fills up this tube and then comes out and spills over and then fills up this reservoir so once this one is empty and this one is full you know that you've got your one liter and you just simply time it. That's that. Nothing to it. Um, anyway, uh, it's been working pretty good. I've, I've done some testing so far and uh, been pretty impressed with it. It, it seems to be reliable. And um, that's that. I just want to show you guys an update. And uh, if you have any comments, let me know. HHO for all. I'm out of here.